Hey guys, it's your boy Mark back with another video here for an unboxing of a PSP game, my first PSP game unboxing, like strictly just the game itself. I know technically with my PSP collection right there, you can see it in the back here, but uh, this is Grand Theft Auto Chinatown Walls for the PSP. I have played this game before, not on any console though, I played it uh, for Android of all things. Um, Back in 2020, um, we were trying to check out this Prezi card, and uh, it was given to me as a gift. This uh, this card, but uh, and you know I wanted to buy stuff online, so I just gave my auntie that card in terms of me buying all the stuff, you know. And um, she was like, "Is it going to work though? Because it looks like you have to activate something, and as a test." I was allowed to buy for the Android on my grandmother's phone, so I can't play it on the Android right now. Um, <coughs> GTA Chinatown Wars for the Android. And then, yep, it worked. Um, if that story made sense. Um, but now I have it for the PSP. I do have a Nintendo DS, um, which Chinatown Wars is also on, but... I just, I'm, I'm not a fan of the DS, honestly. I, I, only, I only ever got three games for the DS, man. Um, but, uh, but, uh, yeah. Chinatown Wars, Grand Theft Auto, uh, um, I really liked this game when I played it on Android, and now I have it for PSP. Here's the thing, though. I am not going to include this Chinatown Wars on my next, you know, overall media update, like, DVD updates and all that. Um, the one after that, though, the, the media update after that, though, I will include this on that because I kind of consider, you know, up to the PSP and Entourage DVD collection, like that's like part of the first batch. I might even include Entourage in the second batch instead since it came after the PSP yesterday. Oh, and by the way, today is January 20th, 2022. And it's been exactly one year since I first started getting YouTube movies. Just how amazing is that? Without further ado, let's unbox GTA Chinatown Walls. Yeah, boy. This includes the map uh, and the, hopefully the booklet too. I need to unbox like this more often now, where I can actually show everything on screen. Um, but we have all this. Oh yeah. Grab the photo. Chinatown Walls for the PlayStation Portable. Lovely, just beautiful. It's beautiful to have a physical copy of this finally. Yeah. Here we go. There we go. GTA Grand Theft Auto Chinatown Walls. The back, that really hot Asian chick, um, who is actually in this game, a, a, an adult star, which is just really hot, you know? Um, funny thing, I actually did start a playthrough series for this game when I played it on my grandmother's Android. I actually screen shared my video gameplay of this game when I was on the Android playing it. But, uh, I might officially cancel that series now since I have it on the PSP and just want to play it for myself. By myself, you know. It was still a fun series, you know, but, uh, yeah, there we go. It's the cover. And I understand if any of you happen to have watched that series and happen to have loved it, I'm sorry. Yeah, but, uh, now that I'm on PSP, I, I will probably not care about the Android version anymore, you know. Yes, it does include 
the poster and and the manual. There's the disc, or the UMD, I should say, and there's the main character, Huang Li, I believe that's his name. What does this manual look like? Oh, good. Classic GTA type manual. You got, uh, when it basically looks like a magazine or a scrapbook, you know? I, I love this. And, uh, there's the poster with the really hot Asian chick on it. Sorry. Uh, that's... Uh, uh, that's cool. Yeah, that, that's cool. Yeah. Ah, fuck. How do I fucking... Ah, yeah. Got it. Got it. Thank you for watching my unboxing of GTA Chinatown Wars, y'all. Peace out. Uh, and thank you for watching and yeah